I'm in the studio version, so I can just put a bit of um, noise reduction on there. Very tiny bit. Seven. About seven. Where are you going? I've got the right one. I did this yesterday. Oh, hang on, it's not catching up. There we go. Power power seven. And my color noise is gone. We go on to this. Now, I don't need the noise reduction, but I just don't have the definition. So you're basically making the same. You've got the same picture, though, but with a bit more um, noise reduction. So if I jump back to the chair, just punch right in on the chair again. Now, remember, this is Pro's Raw with the noise reduction. OK, let's just jump back to Blackmagic Raw. See? Yeah. So you've still lost the detail. I've still, but this is denoised. Let's have another look at our border over here. Okay, so it's smoother. It's been denoised with seven, um, seven things, 6.6 .6 things of noise reduction. Jump back to that. You still haven't quite got the detail back, but it's so subtle. I mean, if you were looking at this level of detail, and, and you were like working to this infinitesimal, infinitesimal level of detail. You're looking too closely, but that's the difference. Um, the other thing, I mean, I suppose with ProRes RAW, it works in DaVinci Resolve and it works in Final Cut. So you've now got ProRes RAW works on everything. B-RAW doesn't work in Final Cut X. So B-RAW is more usable than any of the other formats. And plus, um, you know, it goes into everything. Everything can use Pro, uh, Pro is 